hello tipsters and tricksters and welcome back to my channel and to a new vintage tips and tricks video. Today I'm going to be doing a 1950s housewife diet. I found this in a magazine excerpt online on good old Pinterest. It is a week worth of meals, but I'm going to be mixing and matching and just doing it for the day. This is specifically for losing weight. It is not like the everyday 1950s diet. It is a calorie restriction diet, uh, which looks very bland. <laughs> but we're gonna see what it's really like to eat a 1950s diet for the day. What have you got if you haven't got, haven't got love? My breakfast consisted of a piece of wholemeal toast, one rasher of bacon, but I couldn't find vegan bacon in France, so I had a sausage, a fresh orange, and one pat of butter. This was accompanied by either tea or coffee with no sugar and no milk. I chose tea and they recommended a slice of lemon, which I had never tried before, but it was quite delightful. My lunch consisted of a fresh vegetable salad with cheese, but no dressing, a cup of clear soup, which as it turns out is simply a bouillon cube or a stock cube with hot water, and to top it off a glass of milk. Okay, uh, we are at about 4 p.m. in the afternoon. I ate lunch around about 12, 31 o'clock and I am really hungry. I'm dying to have a snack, uh, <laughs> but obviously that's one of the don'ts. So I won't be doing that, but usually I eat dinner at around about 8.30, being that I live in France, it is quite common to eat later, but I'm not going to make it that far. So I'm going to be eating my dinner around about six o'clock because two more hours seems like a million years right now. The dinner menu called for braised onions, which I had never made before, but it is simply browned onions with a little bit of sugar and some hot water allowed to caramelize for about 25 minutes. This was to be accompanied by a piece of lean steak, which of course I had a vegan version of, and some cauliflower. The appetizer was a piece of fresh melon. The main could be accompanied by a glass of tomato juice, and for dessert I had crackers and cheese.
this wasn't like your standard 1950s meal. This is specifically for dieting for women in the 1950s. I'm certainly not suggesting this is a healthy meal and they don't really suggest that either. It is specifically for losing weight and I certainly wouldn't go about doing so this way. But it was interesting to see what the suggestions were in a ladies magazine. I wasn't as hungry as I thought I would be because it does sound very minimal, but the serving size is not bad. It's more that there's just like no flavor. There's no sauces, there's no salt and pepper. Uh, it was quite bland. I imagine eating this all day, every day for even a week. I would find that really difficult. Am I gonna eat this all the time? No. <laughs> So that's the video guys. I hope you liked it. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and let me know if you'd like to see more of these 1950s lifestyle videos. I'd be happy to make them. It's really fun for me. It's like a whole day of filming. So I quite enjoy that. Just like mix it in with my day. If you want more content, you can always come over to my Patreon. We have a lovely group of people over there. Great little community. We do monthly movie club chats, catch ups. We watch a film and then chat about it on video chat. There's also curated weekly finds behind the scenes content and much more you can of course always come and follow me on my instagram otherwise i will see you in next week's video bye